Susie Phillips and I'm a semi-abstract and impressionist painter and I thought because I've had my exhibitions cancelled due to the horrid COVID-19 virus I put on my own art exhibition in my garden here near Tunbridge Wells in Kent. So I'll start with my studio where I do most of my work and you can see my able assistant, my cat Bobby and I've divided the exhibition into four themes. First we start with my seascapes, we pan over here and I'll go closer. I use these white frames where you have a frame within a frame almost. Um, often the paintings are on oil boards and I bring them forward uh, to create uh, I think quite a, a nice effect. This one's called Spring Storm followed by ships at sea below and Whitstable Harbour and the beach area there which has also included some mixed media and photographs painted in that I, um, I took while I was down there. Um, moving on we will see a couple more seascapes First of all, uh, this one is View from the Cliff and it's based on my memories of the, the Sussex coast, maybe round sort of Eastbourne, Burning Gap way. Uh, we have here Regatta um, as the storm is uh, approaching. Another ship scene but in sunnier times. Sea and Surf which looks at what's sort of going on under the water more. And uh, view from the air. I'm a, a great fan of Peter Lanyon's painting, so this one uh, is kind of influenced by him. As we pan round the garden, I'll move into my more abstract theme with light at the end of the tunnel, a large painting and I think uh, that's something we need at the, at the moment to feel this light at the end of the tunnel. So it's a painting of hope. Choosing now a different colour palette, move into shapes and colours using tones of purples and reds with, with some greens. And I'm quite uh, fond of looking at different shapes and trying to create some balance. More abstract themes follow in a more of a city landscape and then we move into more of a floral impressions of flowers like hollyhocks and lupins and carrying on with the more abstract theme Blue Harbour using again quite a lot of mixed media materials looking at the shapes and colours and my space picture using quite expressive brush strokes, uh, a floral scene, looking at the movement and, and the flow of flowers. And then um, finally we we look at, as we move up the garden, into my landscape theme. Uh, this is a collage painting of my impression of the Downs, somewhere near Brighton, Ditchling, area looking at the river uh, I often go down to Barkham so I've had all those sort of views in my memory as I created this piece and then carrying on with the Downs theme looking at the Downs in winter so here I've looked at the structure of land and using quite cool wintry colours to reflect that sense of, of time as a contrast, I now move abroad and into Tuscany. This is called Vineyard in Tuscany. It's a very large painting. Uh, started with using uh, special crayons and then acrylic washes. Several different colour washes and then a lot of detail in picking out the, the lights and the darks um, and showing the scene that I actually stood and um, painted in. Uh, last year on my holiday in Tuscany. And then finally, following the theme of, of Europe, we go into Provence, and this is the beautiful village of Rousselon, 
and when I was there the sun was setting and shining on the beautiful terracotta roofs and buildings which are kind of okra colours and orange colours so I've accentuated these and then in the background you can see the contrast with the mountains as we go into the painting and the pine trees of the forest that sits below Roussillon. So I hope you've enjoyed looking at my variety of artwork. Uh, all of these are uh, on sale on my website which is Susie S U Z Y Phillips Gallery dot co dot uk and um, prices range from a very small painting might be around ninety five pounds and most of the paintings are in the two three hundred pound mark and large ones are obviously going up to around five six hundred. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you've enjoyed seeing a, a spring scene here in, in Kent and uh, the use of my garden as, a, as an exhibition space.